And now, this. And now, the queue to end all queues. In London, people are continuing to queue for hours to pay their respects to the Queen, who's lying in state at Westminster Hall. The late Queen has done us proud. She's brought the country together. She's brought together probably the best British queue of all time. What I've loved about this queue is that it's a great equaliser. No matter your job, your class, your age, your status, you line up with your fellow Brits. We didn't used to be good at queuing. We were famous for rioting and cutting kings' heads off. It's become this gargantuan human snake engorged on bouquets of flowers and a million mini Paddington bears. So many people turned up to pay tribute, they had to close the queue and put them in a holding pen in another queue. If people don't feel the urge to queue, what does it say about them? The Brits love a queue, but this was the queue of all queues. This queue is different to all other queues I've ever been in. It's the queue to end all queues. And I've spoken to people who had no intention of joining the queue. They just got sucked into it, you know, such as the seductiveness of the queue. Moving on. <laughs>